back with Bobby and JJ Radio. If you're just joining us, we just spoke with Jason Glass, one of the biggest luxury agents here in San Antonio. If you missed any of it, do not cry. You go to BobbyandJJRadio.com. You can download us on SoundCloud. His beautiful face will be on our YouTube channel in a couple weeks. Speaking of beautiful faces, our next guest Hi. is uh, our oh. next guest is Tomas Martinez the third. So you Trey, you the third. I'm the third. So Tomas Martinez is actually the owner of Luxury Magazine, uh, and we are very excited to have him on the show. Uh, so let's talk about the luxury market a little bit in as far as the nation goes. So I know Jason kind of is more um, more of an expert in the San Antonio market, but you, with your connections, have a lot more of the national market, mm-hmm. don't you? So let's talk about that a little bit. Well, this has been a fantastic uh, run for the luxury market over the last, uh, I'd say, probably two years nationally. Um, If you look at Texas as a whole, uh, there's an article that just came out, 35% uh, the luxury market has risen just this uh, over this last year. Wow. So we've had a 35% increase in, in home selling in the luxury market. Sure. When you look at the numbers, you look at Austin. Austin is now number 20. Uh, they're the, wow. the, it, top, in the top 20 of luxury markets. Um, unfortunately, San Antonio is not on that list, but not we're yet. working not on yet. it. Yet. I'm working on it. Jason's actually working <laughs> Jason, on it. Jason, Jason is Jason working on it. That's right. <laughs> where, does, so, where does comfort fall in all this? That comfort is not on the list. No, that's yeah. weird. That's, that's, not, weird. But, uh, that's not comforting. <laughs> yeah, so Austin in, in six months sold over $500 million homes. Uh, and then the top market, San Francisco, was twenty five hundred wow. million dollar homes. Um, so it, it's a great time for the luxury market. And 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 where the big trend is is mm-hmm. international buyers. Sure. Uh, Josh Altman just he just talked about this recently. What he's seeing, I mean, he's in one of the hottest markets in L.A. And what he does is he goes to where the buyers are they're coming from from Russia. They're coming from China, and he's actually putting his properties. Um, out as far as China and Russia to bring these international buyers. It's a it's a wow. different world. Wow. So JJ, you can go back to Mexico and maybe sure. bring some Guadalajara. buyers. Oaxaca, maybe bring some buyers back. Something like that. <laughs> yeah. Well, I mean, I'm usually transporting your family. But anyway, so right. So let's talk about what do you do on, at the Luxury Home Magazine? What do you do for them? Yeah, for Luxury Home Magazine, I started in 2011, okay. and um, my wife and I were realtors at uh, Cooper Sotheby's, and we saw a niche. Yeah. And what I do is I, I help realtors and, and business owners market to San Antonio's most affluent residents. That's let's talk about that. 2011, man. I don't how many how many luxury sales were that year? You know, I I probably say Ask maybe Jason. yeah, it's probably in the seventies. I mean, it probably was seventies. Maybe I know I know the numbers for two thousand three. So if we go all the way back to two thousand three, uh-huh. there were four homes that sold over a million. Wow! So now ten years later in two thousand thirteen, if you just compare those two, we had eighty eight luxury sure. homes over a million dollars. Sure. And so the the market has changed in San Antonio. Now, when you compare it to San Francisco or right. New York, uh, it, it, there's you can't really compare that. That's not comparing you know apples that's a shocking number to three million dollar homes in 2003 and this dude had the foresight it, to do a luxury magazine yeah man. yeah he knew where it was going yeah was, yeah i think it was right around four four yeah. homes in 2003 sold over a million that's crazy yeah and so in 2011 what i saw was this niche that that agents did not have the ability you know my wife and i were agents we got a million dollar listing and we were like well, where do we put it right how do we market that to the proper audience, and uh, we we literally Googled Luxury Home Magazine and found it. It's a franchise. It's located in 16 other cities across the nation. Um, I own San Antonio and sure. the Austin market. And what, differentiate, what differentiates us, as Jason said earlier, is, is the direct mail component. Okay. We direct mail this to 15,000 homes in Bear County, Kendall County, Comal, Guadalupe, Wilson and Bandera. Wow! So this is truly a San Antonio and the Hill Country magazine, right? And that just focuses on that one niche, which is the, the luxury. Yeah, market. luxury market, and, and 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 we really deem luxury as five hundred and above. As Jason sure. said earlier, you know we we are firm believers that that's kind of where it, it starts. Right. In other markets, it's different. You know, I I think as San Antonio continues to grow, when we look at that sweet spot of luxury between five and nine hundred ninety nine thousand, I think what's going to happen is we're going to see luxury start to creep up. That number is going right. to start to go the bar. Higher. The bar. And you're, you're still seeing that climb. You're still year by year where it's going up from 
Absolutely. You look at the numbers. I just started pulling the numbers, and I don't have the exact numbers, so I don't want to say it on air. But sure. between 500 and 999,000, we saw a massive jump Increase. this year. Yeah. Massive jump. Right. Um, so Thanks to you. I'll be sharing that at the Luxury Real Estate Summit. That's awesome. Yeah. So let's transition to that. If you just join us, by the way, this is Tomas Martinez the third. I have to say the third because of the That's trade right. group. And he is the owner of the Luxury uh, Magazine here in San Antonio. You can get more information about him and his magazine and his entire business at LuxuryRealEstateSummit.com. Uh, let's talk about that summit that's coming up. Yeah. So I, me and Bobby went to the last one, and it was inspiring. It was awesome. Great time for us. Yeah, and actually, you weren't the main speaker, but you were my favorite speaker. You're my, the oh, most memorable you. speaker that I remember last year. Thank yeah. you. And nothing to say bad about the Milner real estate agent guy that was there. And we also had the, the mayor of San Antonio at the time. Julian Castro, but we Henry Cisneros. <laughs> yeah, you're good. <laughs> you're up. You're up on it. <laughs> I'm up to date. Yeah, yeah, you are. But yeah, that was a great speech that you did last year. We were really incredible, inspiring. We loved it. So let's talk about this year. What's going yeah. on? Who's the main speaker this year? You know, this year we um, we kept, kind of kept with that um, Bravo's Million Dollar Listing theme. Sure. And we tapped on the shoulder of Luis D. Ortiz yeah, from Million Dollar Listing New, New York, York. Mm-hmm. and uh, got, had a great conversation with him on the phone. He is really excited. Uh, he's Puerto Rican. I'm Puerto Rican. Yeah. So it was a great fit to bring him to San Antonio. Sure. He's got a great story. If you haven't heard his story, he kind of ran away from home at 16, went to New York to just try to figure out what he was going to do with his life. And he has, you know, little by little, he started, he was in movies. He actually made an amazing movie, um, won some awards. And then he started dabbling into real estate. And now he's 28 years old. He's one of the top brokers in the New York market. That's incredible, man. man I, I want to go and see this now. No, we're definitely going. So what about yeah. you? Are you going to be speaking as well? I will be speaking, yes. I'm, I'm excited about it. Last year, um, you know, most people didn't know that I, I have a teaching background. So I was a teacher for almost uh, 11 years sure. and absolutely love teaching. I love training. I love that whole aspect of being in front of people and helping them grow. Right. And so when, when the summit idea came about, my, my wife, this is really the brainchild of this, you know, this, uh, this idea. When she, we started talking about it, we, let's bring something different to San Antonio. Sure. Let's bring education, but people that are doing it outside of our market yeah. and, and, and just kind of make it a big deal. So this year, we've stepped it up. We're at the Tobin Center. Awesome. Um, so it'll be, you know, February 9th. Okay. Um, 2015 at the Tobin Center. It's a Monday morning. So we're going to start the year and uh, the week off right. That week off. Yeah, yeah sure. at the summit. Yeah. So you got, you got our tickets, right? Yeah. They're in this pocket. That's right. They're right here. Yeah. Hey, so let's talk about some of the past guest speakers that you've had. Last year, we had Josh Altman from Million Dollar Listing LA. Right. And uh, it, it, if you heard his message, it, it was really – I went back. I have the videotape of it, and I went back and watched it right. uh, just recently. And I, I was really amazed at the fact that he gave some really strong tips. I thought so. That, that – um, Things that people wouldn't think about in the real estate industry. And so, sure. yeah, it was fantastic. Josh Hoffman did a great job. And I will tell you, the persona he displays on TV mm-hmm. was not what I saw. I got to hang out with him for those two days. He's fantastic. Really neat guy. Cool. Down to earth. He's a dog lover. I mean, you know what I mean? Right. And so the guy's just, he's a neat guy. And no, he sells I, I a really, lot of I really real liked estate. him. I just think he he's like, he's in a different market. He's in this very high market so a lot of his stories really didn't pertain to us where your stories were you know you're from here yeah are you going to do the same story about basketball and, and, no. and touching the net no, we don't know no. we gotta go we gotta go yeah no net story but I got a new one so hey so if you want some tickets to this luxury summit they can go to luxuryrealestatesummit.com that's correct and there's going to be different seating obviously because it's at the Tobin Center this time that's correct okay so luxuryrealestatesummit.com is how people can go out there if you're a real estate agent or in business I think everyone should but I do appreciate your time coming on Bobby and JJ Radio we're very excited for you to be here Thank you. And if you've missed any part of the show, you go to BobJJRadio.com. We'll definitely see you next week with some more information.